Hello, everybody. It is Wednesday, March 31st, and here are your national days. Wait, March 31st? You've made it through the month of March. Yes, another month down. Woohoo! Here we come, April. We're coming for you. All right, so let's get to our days. The first day is Crayola Crayon Day with over 400 different colors that they've come up with since 1903. Crayola's been uh, at the forefront of making crayons, so we've all had that pack of Crayola crayons. And whether it's uh, going down to that, that simple set of eight or all the way up to the ridiculous whatever you can get. Uh, but uh, lots of different colors and lots of different pictures being drawn with those. It's World Backup Day. Uh, and as we learned earlier this month with uh, Toy Story 2, you definitely may need to make sure you have a backup of things. So today's day, go through, backup everything. All right, it's Manatee Appreciation Day. These are these large uh, creatures that are down in uh, the Florida area, just gentle giants, generally just eating you know, a bunch of like the, the sea cabbage and that kind of stuff, but um, really, really cool to see one of those uh, up close and personal. Uh, but Manatee Appreciation Day today. It's Eiffel Tower Day, so this uh, celebrates the tower being completed in 1889, uh, taking two years, two months, and five days to build. Uh, so, uh, pretty cool thing, the Eiffel Tower there, very iconic. It's Bunsen Burner Day, so uh, Robert Bunsen invented this, uh, this uh, burner in 1854 uh, because he needed something that was able to burn hotter and cleaner uh, for the flame because of his uh, laboratory experiments. So this, uh, he created the, the Bunsen Burner on this day. So kind of, a, kind of a cool thing there, all right? He just needed something newer and cleaner and he created it. Pretty neat. All right, uh, let's see. It's uh, clams on a half shell day. Yeah, I'll take this. So this is when you're gonna have the clams. They're gonna be, you know, on one shell, clean them out. So just all you gotta do is just eat them right off the shell. Um, sign me up, I'm in on this one. And it's tater day. So tater day means that we're celebrating the potato, which is kind of cool. There's over 4,000 different varieties of potatoes. That's incredible. Uh, so whatever it is that you want to have on this day, go for it. All right, so tater day. Let's take a look and see what our fact of the day is here. The waffle iron inspired one of the first pairs of Nikes. All right, so Bill Bowerman was a track and field coach in the 1950s who didn't like how running shoes were made. He first created the Cortez shoe um, but still wanted to make the shoe even lighter uh, so that it could be worn on various surfaces. During a waffle breakfast with his wife in 1970, the idea came to him of using the waffle texture on the sole of the running shoe. The waffle sole shoe made their appearance at the 1972 U.S. Olympic track and field trials in Eugene. Hey, that's pretty cool. So a waffle iron helped create the iconic waffle design on the bottom of shoes. Hey, there you go. Can't make this stuff up, everybody. All right, so hopefully you have a great day. Go find your uh, crayons, draw a picture. Hey, and if it's good, we'll send me a picture of it. Maybe we'll post it somewhere, all right? So have a great day, everybody. We'll see you right back here tomorrow.